Hey everybody, playing some uh, Rise to Ruins. I've got Fatima here, and Hello. this has switch integration. This is gonna be super, super casual late night stream. Uh, expect rambling, expect reading off the chat constantly, uh, constant distractions. If you're watching this later on YouTube uh, to learn about Rise of Ruins, uh, you picked the wrong video. I've been playing this for about six hours so far, and I'm really enjoying it. Hi, Wolf. Hi, Wolf. It is I, the one who likes carrots. That's his one defining uh, personality trait. I like that. He plays Friday. Our man Friday... is good for his beta carotene and vitamin A. Our man is equipped. Yeah, he shows up to our uh, Friday the 13th streams. And when he's Jason, you hear him coming because he's eating baby carrots. It's pretty great. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, it's the, the scariest Jason is when the screen distorts and the horror music starts and you hear chewing carrots and... I don't know why we've never done a Bugs Bunny joke about that. Uh, oh, thanks on Handy for the 205 bits. He says, here, take these for making me stay up late. So we're gonna play the game. The Twitch integration with this game is, it's like a city builder and God Sim mixed together. And um, as we get villagers, they should automatically be named after the 40 of you in the chat. Somehow we have more of you right now for this completely unannounced shit stream than we did yesterday when I did a announced a month ahead of time and a reminded once a week stream. Because that's just what my show is like. People like the shit streams. They don't like the well-organized good streams, uh, which further compounds our uh, amazing nickname of the best worst stream on Twitch, which I am very proud of. Oh. You can interpret the best worst stream however you want to interpret it. It's MDB tube. That's that's a website that's not going to happen. All right. So I've only played traditional mode. Survival mode it says is how the game is meant to be played. I've only played a little bit of traditional, which is like a a lower difficulty to learn the game. So we're going to go survival. So this is a cool game. Uh, I'm gonna skip like the tutorial -y stuff because I feel like I could teach you. And again, um, the font is teeny fucking tiny. Yeah, the the font is gonna be basically illegible for you guys, and there's unfortunately literally nothing I can do about that. The reason is this is a Java game, and Java sucks balls. My monitor is really big; it's 1440p. Now I could turn the game to 1080p to make it legible for you. Whoops, no I can't, this is Java. It doesn't have resolution options and the game doesn't have UI scaling options. So I can read it and no other human on earth can including Fatima because she's looking at a 1080p monitor. And for those of you wondering if you'd be able to read it if I made it full screen, no, probably not. Thankfully you really don't need to read anything in this game. You'll understand what I'm doing just from watching me. All right. RuneScape is still a thing? It's still really popular. It's yeah. one of the biggest streamed games on Twitch. Um, yeah, so we have uh, 20 people in, in Limbo, which are, you know, people I can send out as a minor, minor god, send out into a place to populate it. Uh, there are 14 males, six females, and one child. I can read those, says Jordan. You're lying to me. You don't know how to read. You're just hitting random buttons and it's coming out to proper sentences. Don't you fucking lie to me. I'm insulted. Okay, so we get to pick a starting location. Now, you can make a village at all of these locations. If you're wondering about the not at all smooth zoom, uh, sorry, epileptics. There's nothing you can do about that. It's, it's, again, programmed in Java. It's a great game. It's programmed in Java, though, which is never good. So I don't know if any of the start locations do anything different either than looking different. I would imagine they have different enemies. I tried a few different places and didn't notice any massive differences. So I'm just going to click a place and we're going to we're going to roll with narrow path. All right, let's load it up. Did it even give you options? For what? Other than narrow path? Yeah, all of those dots I could have clicked. And uh, let me tap out and just raise the volume a little because it's really fucking quiet. I was about to say, why do I have a headset on? There's like no sound. Yeah, your headset's even quieter than mine. It's not bad. All right, 
So we gotta start camp. So let's look around the map a little bit for a good location. Um, okay, well, you wanna have woods and stone nearby. Makeshift housing, large fountain. We can repair some of these things if we want to later. Red crystal, we do want crystal nearby. Oh, hey, there's like a whole little, there's a farm and housing. Radiance pool, that's cool. A doggo house, I hate that it's called that. Radiance pool, this is actually a really cool location here. I think we'll start here. No crystal nearby though. Ooh, that hurts. No crystal at all nearby. You know what? It'll be a bit of a challenge. We'll do it. Uh, let's start right out here. Is this like a city builder? City builder, god sim, tower defense. It's a little of a lot of things. You want to make a, a dry bread page on the YouTube wikia, but you don't know how to do it? Yeah, I'm not sure how either. Uh, go ahead and make one, though, and watch as it gets deleted the next day for me being irrelevant. <laughs> like what happened to me on uh, Wikipedia. Wikipedia is the most fucking ridiculous thing in the world in terms of what they consider to be relevant enough to be to have a Wikipedia page. I know, like, local government motherfuckers who have one follower on Twitter uh, who have a Wikipedia page because apparently they're relevant enough, and yet... Me, with the 11 million views I have on my channel, I don't count. In the Fucking same way Wikipedia. That, like, a YouTuber who's not like PewDiePie or Markiplier are not relevant. Like, you need to be pretty big or they don't let you have a Wikipedia page. That's weird. It's fucking dumb. All right, again, I'm skipping these tutorial things because I can teach you guys it faster. So I'm gonna do a lot of things fairly quickly, right off the bat, and the reason for that, uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, the reason I'm getting some of these things done so quickly is I know for a fact things are gonna get dangerous quickly. And I'll explain in a moment what I'm doing right now, because it's not gonna be immediately obvious what the fuck I'm doing. All right. I'm happy with all of that. They're building that. Okay, so we have 12 builders right now and one spare person. Um, these are all builders, so their job is they build. So we've tried to claim that makeshift house. They're just getting the supplies to repair it. If they're completely out of supplies, they'll go get the supplies. I told them they can cut these woods and they can mine this stone. And so they're doing that. But we want to get dedicated people for that at some point. We also have spells up here. One of my spells is Labor Golem. I'm just going to cast that. This blue bar, this tiny blue bar, is our magic power. Regenerates over time and also regenerates as we put our cursor near little spirits that fly into it and make sound effects. Which is fun. You probably shouldn't point the microphone towards my hand on the clicky clacky keyboard. Stop clicky clacking into my microwave. Are you disrespectful? See, this is why we got that microphone stand for you coming in. They think that you have enough with that world-famous Canadian sand. Yep, that red sand. Red Welcome sand. to Canada. PEI. PEI is known for its red sand. Not well known enough for it, apparently, because you don't know. <laughs> All I know PEI for is potatoes and the Acadians. That's about it. And they have, like, the most normal-sounding Canadian French. It's not Quebecois. Prince Edward Island, potatoes. They have room to grow potatoes on Prince Edward yes, Island? They do. It's genuinely a half an hour drive from one end to the other end of that province. We can totally tell that you two are married, says David Corporeal. What, the way we talk? Probably. Where? Where? What? Where? Where what? Was that comment? That. That one. Oh my! That one right there. <laughs> I completely missed that. Yeah, the, the second comment. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Like I've already, I've already resigned myself to the fact that I'm gonna be staring at the screen and you're just gonna stare at me, approvingly and yet disapprovingly. All right, so we've made a farm. Farms don't quite work how you might think they do. So I'm moving people from builders to farm right now. So farmers gather food. As you'd imagine. You'd think they'd like grow food right here, and it looks like they're growing food right here, later in the game. Right there. Uh, but in reality, they just kind of go gather food, and we have food right here. Uh, potatoes. So we're gonna mark it off 
uh, so that they know to get the radishes and the potatoes. There we go. So they'll gather that stuff for the village. Perfect. Uh, we're gonna need defenses by night too. So really, really early we want a bowyer. It's kind of loud. Um, nomads! Nomads will occasionally come through, and if you have, uh, enough housing, then they'll join you. How do I want to set this up? I think I'm okay. You know what? what? No, I don't want that building? there. What is that? This is a bowyer. Do you what know what it? A... Well, it says over here bowyer, but it Where? says over here fletchery, Where? I think, Where? later. Where does it say anything? This. Yes. It's a bowyer. Yeah. They but make... what is it? They make bows, and they make arrows, and they make quivers. They make archery equipment. We need that because they make us arrows, which we'll need for defensive right. towers. I never took archery. That's right. I don't I know just, this shit. Uh, I didn't either. They actually have a archery class in a lot of major cities around here. It's weird. Uh, Zeltrix says, this is giving me Dwarf Fortress vibes. Um, I wouldn't call it Dwarf Fortress-like. It's too- it's- I mean, it's a whole different genre. Um, Dwarf Fortress is very cool, though. Honestly, Wolf, I don't see shit that's right in front of my face. There'll be words- Don't bang your hands on the table, it's deafening for them. I'm so sorry. We have really high compression on this mic, so when you bang the table, it shakes this whole stand, and that's really loud for them. Here, let me lay this down. Yeah, that's why I have that there, actually, so is- don't do that, don't Jesus, know. Fatima. Please stop doing that. I'm sorry. I'm very animated. There, it's bunched up a lot, and please try not to slam your hands on it. It's really loud for them. I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, so it should name people. It should be named after people in the chat. Let me just click some random people. We got Hawkeye there. Labor Golem, you don't count. Eli Woodcomb. We definitely don't have one of those in the chat. I wonder if the Twitch integration's working properly. It might be busted. You know, none of these people are named after people in the chat. It might be just people who join after your initial few. I think that might be it. We'll wait until some nomads join and see what their names are. After your initial few? Initial group of people. Oh, I see. Name one after me. I don't name them, guys. It's auto-named after people in the chat. Uh, okay, so we have a building limit of four out of eight. So we have four buildings. Uh, we can have up to eight. Oh, right. We need, we actually need a proper lumber shack. Um, so we're going to get that going now. Okay. Yeah, this is what we want. Probably right here is good. So lumber shack is just a place where we can have, uh, where we can have lumberjacks. They'll just constantly gather wood for us. And let's speed up the game. Yeah, yeah, speed control warning. There we go. We got it va uh, vastly sped up now. And I'll just occasionally summon uh, labor golems to speed things up. Our Be friends are mating. Because we're having a bit of a... What? I said our friends are mating. Oh, yeah, it's good. Yeah, it says down there in text that there's no fucking way anyone but me and Fatima can read. Again, I would make the UI way bigger if I could, but the game does not have resolution options or UI options. Which is why this is a casual stream, everybody. This would not be good for a proper playthrough. So, let me slow down the game a little bit. So we can explore the world a little bit here and look for things to click on. Like that. There we go. There's a suspicious key there now. Oh, there's a little bit of corruption over here, so this is where enemies will come from. They're actually not that far away from us. If we see little glowing circles that aren't on top of these, we can click them and get little keys and little chests, and it's pretty cool. I'm not seeing any right now. Just kind of keep an eye out for them every once in a while. Any games you're looking forward to at the moment, Mandroot? Mm, Morgan is healing. Not that really Only comes to mind. Detroit being human, but she thinks it's PS4 only. Uh, that's the next David Cage game, right? What? Um David Cage is still making games? I thought someone, like... Killed him? Institutionalized or committed the man. No, he's still making games. I think that's his next game. And if I remember correctly, if that's his next game, then I am waiting with bated breath because his games are fucking hilarious travesties. Uh, Heavy Rain, I legitimately enjoyed. 
Um, Jason. 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 I legitimately enjoyed that one. Um, Ellen Page Simulator is one of the worst games I've seen in a while. One of the most funny bad games I've seen in a while. And Indigo Prophecy was really cool for the first third of the game, which I think is what everyone says, is that game is really good for the first third, and then it's fucking terrible. All right, so I'm setting up a maintain order so that our Fletcher will always maintain enough crossbow bolts, um, bows, and quivers. So they're just hanging out in there and making that for us out of wood. We have our lumberjacks over here collecting wood, and our builders will build. Let's get that doghouse built early. So it's only six wood to fix it up, because it was uh, one we're just claiming. Iron ore, gold ore, nice. So I'm going to harvest mining facility. We need one of these. I think I'll just put it right there for now. So that is the same thing as a lumberjack's place, but it's for stone, and they also get ores out of it for metals. Who is Ricky and why does he need chicken chips? I'm so curious now. What are chicken chips? Do I want chicken chips? <laughs> Who's Ricky? What? I don't know. Plate Bogart. We need an explanation. Roll stress. I don't know what he's referencing. You need to know everything. <laughs> Whoa, it's raining. Bogart, I forget, was it New Brunswick you're from? Or was it Halifax? I don't remember if it was Nova Scotia or New Brunswick that he's from. Either way, it's probably some foreign, foreign maritime bullshit that I don't understand. Maybe it's- That or he's in, he is in the States now. Maybe this is some American thing. Americans have weird food. Because he it betrayed us. Thing. Ellen Page was on Trailer Park Boys. Oh, it's a Trailer Park Boys thing. Oh. Yeah, it's Nova Scotia. Got it. Oh my god. Scotland got so shit, they had to make a new one. Wolfman, I'm so sorry. I'm rude and disrespectful. I accept it. I accept it. Chicken chips are great. What the fuck are chicken chips? Do they not make them here? They might, but they might call them something different. I'm Rio Bops' wife. What? I'm Riobop in the chat. Where? It's Bogart's wife. Where? That. I can't see. That one. Yay. You have better eyesight than me. What I the actually, fuck? Listen, this is real stress. <laughs> what? Can you not see colors or something? Wait, hold on. Are you drowning? No, you're just an idiot. I'm not okay. Not drowning. I just can't see. <laughs> okay, we need more houses Sorry. badly. Honestly, he needed he needed to get away from this country. I can't say that I blame him for leaving. No, I can't blame him. Okay, we're building another house because we have a lot of homeless right now. Chicken. Uh, power. twelve of twelve of our sixteen people are homeless. So we're making homes. We're also upgrading the camp so we can have more buildings because we're at eight buildings. Oh, Wisconsin is like cow country. What's cow country? Wisconsin. Wisconsin? Yes. I associate it with cheese. Yeah, dairy country. So mm. I mean, how Wisconsin's Wisconsin cool. I like Wisconsin. All right, I okay. might use some regrowth spells soon. Chicken powder from ramen packs on chips. It's a weird Atlantic Canadian thing. Ew. That sounds like it could be good, but um you know what? You can't knock it until you try it, you know? It's that type of thing. No, not as good as egg fried rice. Honestly, you can get that shit anywhere. Egg fried rice? You, you can get it from me. That's where you can get it, because <laughs> I have the best egg fried rice. Better than any egg fried rice that I've ever seen, because I've only had the kind that I made, and so it's the best kind. I feel like I'm going to get Chinese one day. Like, I'm gonna get Chinese food one day, allow me to specify. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'll be like, you know what? I'm gonna get some egg fried rice. And I'll be like, you know what? This is not as good as Mandroot breads. This I, is... I was gonna make a joke, then I remember Twitch would ban me for it. Oh, because they're dear. F fucking ridiculous. Because they are ridiculous with the rules. <sighs> Didn't you 
tell me last time to not wear a crop top on stream? Because yes. Because have been showing too much skin. Yes. Seriously, that is something that they're concerned about. But the worst part, if it were you streaming, just you, you'd be fine. But because it's my channel, I'd get banned. That's the worst part. Because that's how Twitch is. Why don't you just change your gender to female? Because they want to... We can't make a joke about that. I'm not making a joke. I'm I'm making no, a I true mean, proposal. I that know. We change your actual gender. Well, this is this is Canada, so we can do that. But the thing is, if we make a joke about that, or if they think we're making a joke about that, they're gonna get fucking mad and give me a warning. <laughs> Twitch, look, you don't understand the depths of how ridiculous Twitch can be. Okay, their rules are not fair. They are not evenly enforced. This is the world we live in. I play by different rules that you do on Twitch. I have stricter rules than you do. This is just a fact. Is this like the time that I walked into the 7-Eleven looking really bitchy and a man just gave me a free drink? Ga yeah, you get free <laughs> shit all the time. I have never in my life gone up to a service counter and gotten free shit. You get it like every week. You just get free shit constantly. Do you think a guy looking like me just gets free shit? No, it's because cashiers hit on you and then they give you free shit. Men play by different rules and the rules fucking suck. All right, I'm gonna make some bow towers because we need it because there's a headless guy attacking things. Wolf, you're not wrong. What's he saying? He says that I get free shit because I'm an attractive female. I know that I'm cute, and I get away with bloody murder. Yeah, she gets away with ridiculous shit because of it. Hey, Truth. I've told you about Truth, right? No. He's the one I play Factorio with. He's gonna teach me uh, Dwarf Hi, Fortress Truth. one day. Yeah, he's awesome. Everybody go follow Truth. All right, it's really dark out there, and there are already enemies arriving, so we're building towers. Oh, Grimar, you're so kind. It's a uh, stone, wood, and a little bit of crystal. We've marked off some crystal to harvest over here. Um, our build builder's about to get it. Uh, there's a headless guy attacking. Now, we do have a decent amount of bows, so some people do have fighting equipment, but most people are just punching. We have no melee equipment. I took too long to get these towers because I'm useless. Metalizer has subscribed. Oh, thanks, Metalizer. Subscribe for three months in a row. Congratulations on the three months. Does it make sense to congratulate you for sending money to me? Does Happy that make sense? I'm not sure that makes sense. Sorry. Hey, what? It's someone's birthday? No, I'm congratulating him on his three-month anniversary of being a subscribe. Are you paying attention oh. to the stream? Oh, now, that's Twitch subscriber, to be specific. I mean, he's been, I, he's been watching the channel for years. I know. Damaged building? Yeah. Yep. Uh, builders will fix the buildings. They have little health bars above them. Wow, a lot of headless attacked. No one's dead, though. We still have a population of 16 right now. Did not we start off with a pop of 19? No, we start with a population of 13. Oh, so we've gotten three people. Now, we do have a bit of homeless. We have four homeless people. These are the headless dudes who are attacking. We don't have any guards. Wow, there's a shitload of them. I think we might just die here. We might, if they can't get those buildings done. They're trying to finish them. Then they need to load them up, too. Yeah, they're trying to finish it while they're under attack. I got these... I didn't get these towers done nearly fast enough. I didn't think that this would be such a jump in difficulty. It's a lot bigger of a jump than I thought it would be. Um, you know what? I totally forgot. I can make a holy golem. Not enough influence? Damn. Let's try and get some influence. We can get it by... Uh, they are killing some people. They are using their bows and killing some headless. They're not very strong. As you can see, they're ganging up so much and barely getting anything done. They haven't killed anyone. I'm just going around trying to pick up all the little bits of influence I can to try and summon a holy golem. Because that's a thing that'll fight and help them. I'm getting little bits of it off the bodies. If I click the bodies a bunch, they explode and give me more. Which is cool. Oh, some of our people are getting pretty beaten up. They might need to go in their houses to heal. Uh, the dog house is going to get destroyed. Not a big deal. We don't even have a dog yet. Come on, we're so close to having enough. Dog there we go. Has been destroyed. Yeah, there we go. We have a holy golem there. I don't know how good they are. 
He doesn't look like he's great, but he's doing a decent job. Better than they are. Bye, Kong Dong. Ah, fuck. They destroyed the base of that tower. We'll have to get a new one going. Oh, man. They destroyed that whole building. Mating! Yeah, some people are mating. That holy golem's actually putting in some decent work. How do you know that they're mating? Uh, it told me. Where? It told me in the very center of the screen on a thing I got rid of. Uh, okay, that right, holy golem's right. actually putting yeah, in a shitload see. of work. The holy golem's almost dead. Do we have enough for another one? Almost. Come on, come on. Here we go. Got another one going. All right, you guys gotta get that Good done night, already. Yurio. See you, Yurio. This game's fun. So many, like, it's way easier on the next difficulty down. Such a big jump in difficulty. It's crazy. We have more homelessness. They destroyed one of the houses. I like that ukulele music. Okay, they're getting That's the tower down here done. Good. Yo, man, Drew, is that snow that was going across the screen? Like the white? No. Dust? No, it's like, um, it's supposed to be like magic stuff. Okay, we got another tower going over there because the enemies are mostly going to be coming from over here. There's still that headless running around. Yeah, you get back in town. Fuck, there's still attacks going on. This is crazy. Bye, Unhandy! See you, Unhandy! Yeah, Fatima's on chat de detail a lot right now while I'm uh, trying to, you know, do damage control here. Everyone is leaving me. I guess I'll never be on the stream ever again. Yeah, it's because they hate us. I thought that was because they hated me. Because I'm causing real problems for you. Um, no, it's because they hate us. Those people. It's because we're, it's because we're, it's because we're bad people. You're trying to talk into the mic and then you just ram it into my I teeth. I don't even. <laughs> trying to make sure there's always a mic. <laughs> I'm, I'm having such a conflict. I'm like, do I give it to you? Do I not? Is this mine? Don't you have one in front of you? Like what's going on? <laughs> it's okay. You'll understand how mics work one day. It's a learning experience. All right, we've got a labor golem there to try and help out with repairing this stuff. We actually took a lot of damage there. Wow, this is so much harder. Oh, right. It's the middle of the night for Europeans. Yeah. It's pretty late for us. It's 10, 18 p.m. Whatever. Okay, <laughs> so we have, we have two bow towers. We've got them loaded with arrows. Hi, Sonic Blast! I mean, Sonic 21 Blast, but you know. Um... Let's Thank get you all. let's get some You're walls. So kind. Oh right, we Jordan, need more build range up there. And then a uh, wooden fence there. Okay, it's just starting with a fence. That's not gonna be enough, but we don't have a whole lot of wood to go around right now. Okay, uh, we need to also get our infrastructure built up and everything. Like we need housing so that we get more people. So rebuild that house. Would we be allowed to drink on stream, or is that a We're allowed problem? to drink. I think it's like the one Is my mic still really low? It shouldn't be. Um, it should be decent. I'll probably still be louder. Does she sound okay to everybody else? Alright, they're building that. Good. Oh, we have two spare people. One of you can be mining. The other one, builder. We just want lots of builders right now to really get things up and running. Okay, no drinkable water. Right, that's what I've been dragging my feet on. Does this do anything? That unplugs the microphone. Oh. Jesus Christ, Fatima. Is it back in? Yes. <laughs> Does this do anything? Pulls the cord out of the mic? Wow. Jesus Christ. Did you think it was a button? Yeah, I thought that it was like a volume. I was trying to make sure that it was good. That I was kosher for sound. 
slams her elbow on the table. I didn't slam my elbow on the table. Listen, I'm Middle Eastern. That's not a real joke, smiley gamer. Relax. What'd he say? <laughs> Does this do anything? But she blows up the house. <laughs> See, you're allowed to make that joke, but once again, if I were to make it, I'd get fucking banned. <laughs> Look, you can talk about the explosive offense of Mustafa Ali, <laughs> but I'm not allowed to make a joke about that. It's like when someone's like, oh, this is explosive, and um, I'll be like, no, no, no. I'll be the authority on that. Yeah. I'm Middle Eastern. We specialize in that shit. And before some Twitch staff fucking gets on me about the, the explosive offense of Mustafa Ali, he's a fucking pro wrestler, a commentator. It described his offensive maneuvers as explosive, and we had a hearty laugh about it. Our man approved the use of language. I don't think it's offensive. Also, I know how to fight. Come for me. Is there a problem, sir? You've never even had someone try to punch you. I Starting can't. some training does not count. Are you disrespectful? I'm honest. That's what I You're am. You're disrespectful. Are you interviewing me now? <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> hey, everybody. How's it going? Welcome, <laughs> welcome to the double MDB stream. Our man's really trying it. I'm so sorry. I keep doing that thing that I'm not supposed to do. You know, you know the thing you're not supposed to do? Pro tip. Don't Pro slam anything on the table? Yeah. You're, you notice how like that, that camera on us looks like it's a fucking earthquake all the time? That's you. That's you shaking the entire table. What do you have to say about this? I am rude and disrespectful and deeply apologetic. That's what I have to say about that. <laughs> this interview is over. You heard it here first. <laughs> now kiss? That's gay. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna get in trouble for that, aren't I? Oh, what? God. Never mind, I'll tell you off show. <laughs> the least offensive joke of all time. Apparently kissing makes you triple gay and it's confirmed in the chat. Don't make jokes about that. We're probably not allowed. Mm. Bogart's here. Everybody probably thinks he's gay from Twitter. Why? Does he count? Does he make us a man? You ever been on his Twitter? No. His banner picture is him in a banana hammock showing his ass off in a pool. Does our man have a nice tone tush? Yes. He shows it off because he has something to show off. <laughs> and of course his wife's laughing. <laughs> I like that. She knows it's fucking true. We are deeply entrenched in this meaningful discussion it's, about Bogart's tush. It's not an insult. He takes care of himself. Uh, yeah, Bogart, Bogart says tush. Twitter wishes I was gay. Exactly. <laughs> I'm sure you've been hit up by plenty of uh, gay men. Me? Oh, right, Bogart. Bogart. That's right. <laughs> the man with the tush. The yeah, the gay tush. people always hitting you up. Oh, there we go. Sonic Blast 21 and too much Dog, what? Is there someone in the chat called Too Much Dog? Because if so, I love you. That's Too an incredible name. Too Much Dog is a fucking hilarious name. <laughs> That's a great name. Too Much Dog? Please let that be somebody from the chat. That's a fucking great name. Where, where is this Too Much Dog? Uh, they joined the, the, they joined the village. The notification's already gone for it. All right, do we have any homeless still? No drinkable water, right. I fucking forgot again, because there's a crisis. People are like dying of thirst right now. Okay, first we're getting a well and we're getting it by the farm. This is the farm, right? No, that's the bow. Oh, right, our farm was destroyed, shit. Uh, we're gonna want to farm up here. So I want to, uh... oh, right. It is under food and water, isn't it? That's condensed to one thing. 
What about Morgan? I think that's Morgan. Her username. Is it? Uh, it flashed. But go like gore a f uh, fantasy gore FX. Yes. Yeah, that's that's Morgan. Thank you for the bits. I need to stop doing. This do you thing. do you know what bits are? I don't know if I've I ever explained, you explained to you. I think explained to me in passing, and I never actually pay attention. It's money. Um, oh. it's it's money through like Twitch and uh, through Twitch and Amazon. Mm -hmm. It comes in with my Twitch paychecks, so it comes in very late, unfortunately, which is annoying. But it like shows up looking special in the chat and shit like that. Mm -hmm. Um, a bit is a cent, American. Well, is people are dying of dehydration. At least the person who died isn't named after the chat. Somehow we're gaining more viewers than we're losing, even with all the Europeans going to bed. Okay, so we are out of drinkable water. Some, someone died. A lot of people are dehydrated right now. No available wood. Let's uh, do a growth spell on those trees. There we go. And we'll get some of that back from them cutting the trees. All right, mark off a bit more of that for cutting down. Nope, oh, another person died. Uh, Chris died of dehydration. Sorry, I'm doing really bad. This is why I say these are casual streams, um, because I don't fucking pay attention to anything but the chat. Why are you burning the island down? It's not an island. Why are you burning the town down? I'll give you that. It's a town. It's more of a hamlet. Bye, Metalizer! Our man is going the fuck to sleep, and he will see you later. Go the fuck. Fuck to sleep. See you later. Come on, get that done already. Fuck. Yep, uh, Brad's dead. Hope none of you are emotionally attached to Brad. Brad the Builder. Who's Brad? The Builder. One of eight left. Guys, you guys gotta get that fucking well done already so you can drink some water. Would you guys prioritize that? <laughs> Apparently not. Apparently that's not what they're here to do. There, I just highly prioritized it. Please get that fucking finished. The farm's not even gonna work without water. I can see people losing health right now. Oh, another one died. I was just about to drop a healing aura on him. God, that's no another one builder liked dead. Him anyway. Yeah, Brad's d fucking dead, and it's all your fault. It is my fault, in fairness. Guys, the well. Finish the fucking well. You have plenty of wood here. Builders, get it done. Okay, they're working on it, they're working on it. Another guy died. Uh, it was, a, uh, it was a lumberjack. Uh, I want a water master. There, we have someone who's gonna go work at the well just bringing water to everybody. Cause fuck, we need it. At least we have some bow towers, which is nice. Yeah, they're already sh shooting at some slimes, which are good cause slimes are poisonous. Okay, good. People are starting to slowly get water at the well now. Come on, get dehydrated people first. I don't want anyone dying on me. Okay, this is good. The The headless guys are dying pretty well now. And we're gonna make a, lo a labor golem over there. Ghosts, sometimes you can resurrect dead villagers. At dusk and noon, you'll occasionally see some of your deceased villagers wandering around. If you notice one, zap it with the resurrect spell. Do I have the resurrect spell on my bar? Um, no, let's get that on my bar. These are all my spells. Resurrect. Okay, can I afford that spell? It's a bit expensive. I think it's this whole bar. But I'll see if I see a ghost. I'm not really sure what the ghost will look like. Okay, headless, good. Okay, these bow towers are really helping a lot. I would still really like to play Earthbound with you on a stream. Yep. I do want to do a stream through that with you. Chat, if that's something you're interested in, let me know. We can make it happen sooner. Yeah, she likes Earthbound. I like Earthbound too, it's good. I almost finished it, and then I'm not sure what happened to my save file because, like, I lost my old hard drive, which had a lot of, like, stuff on it that was really important. Well, I can tell you what happened to your uh, save file. It's dead with the dead hard drive. Honestly, that's... that's... That's accurate. Your hard drive died. It's dead. 
It's in a dump for years. It's not in a dump, and it's not in a dump for years, no less. It's in the landing closet. You never got rid of your dead laptop from years and years ago. No. Why? Because I have to replace it. You have a new laptop! I don't have a new MacBook Pro. Ugh. Why are you keeping the old dead one? Because one day, um, one day. Oh, thank God it's raining. That's good. I feel like I have to gut the thing for parts. Probably not, no. I don't know. Okay, let's get a small fountain in town over here. The chat looks really excited about Earthbound. Good. All right, we probably want to start some fires soon because it's really hard to see anything. Is Tad still up? Is what? Tad. Uh, yeah, but I haven't gotten an email from them in fucking weeks. That's why I stopped promoting it on the weekly vlogs. It's really frustrating working with them. They used to be so good at communicating for like a full year, and then now it's just pulling teeth getting a response. It's so frustrating. Do they still pay out at the normal rate? Like, I haven't gotten a payout in like a month. Oh, shit. Yeah, and I'm, I'm getting annoyed. That's why I'm not promoting it right now. I'm waiting until I hear proper feedback from them. Because I don't know if I should just tell people to stop using it or if it's about to get fixed or, like, if it's busted even. I don't know if it's busted. Who knows? So I don't know if I should tell people to stop using it because then they'll never start again. So I don't know what the fuck's going on with it. Then they stopped communicating after the hurricane last year? No, we got like one more email since then telling us that they were going to fix their communications issues. Of which they didn't. That sucks. Yeah. Oh god, I gotta get some more points. That's a ghost right there. The ghost of Brad. We can bring Man. back Brad. Isn't Brad the fan favorite? Everybody likes Brad, right? Right? I feel you 110% truth. What do you say? Never throws out old computer equipment and it's oh, like yeah, a me good say. thing. What? Yeah, same here. I have tons of old computer equipment, but it's like good stuff. Mm -hmm. Not Fatima's old MacBook from high school. What? I said I have good stuff, not your old MacBook from high school. Do okay. I not have enough for a resurrect spell even at max? I think so. That Damn. Thing lasted like seven years of constant use Ooh. and abuse. I did it. Brad's freezing death. I just revived him, guys. There we go. Brad's alive, everybody. Unreality asks. What's your least favorite game? Uh, the Uncanny X-Men on NES. It's the worst game I've ever played. I grew up with that. It's fucking horrendous. It is not funny bad, it's just awful. Okay, we can get a farmer now. Good. Oh god, everyone's talking about the red bread now. The what? An old, old reference. Uh, okay. Who's the rad brat? A YouTuber. Still in this life? He is not dead, as far as I know. Still in the YouTube scene. As far as I'm aware. It's quite big. Alright, are we safe? About as safe as we can be right now. Okay, um, let's start upgrading some houses. We do have enough houses for everybody now, but we want to upgrade it so that we have room for people. So we can do high occupancy houses, which are low quality housing, but lots of uh, housing capacity. Standard, and then high quality. The higher the quality, the better it is for their happiness and their sleeping and their health regen, but the less space there is. I think I'm just gonna, oh God, there's like 40 wood and 16 rocks though. We don't even have enough wood. But we need population badly. Get another lumberjack. There we go. Oh no, we can't. This person just hasn't fucking gotten around to taking their job yet. Yeah. Great. That person needs. They must be asleep or something. More mating. Alright. We're getting a lumber golem, or a labor golem to get lumber. I really want to start some fires, too, so we can see farther. Because 
vision is an issue right now. We'll do that for now. Although that makes us out of building slots, so after that we're going to have to upgrade the small settlement again into a large settlement. Which thankfully is very inexpensive. Sick of holding the mic? I'm just giving it a little break. Yeah, it's okay. Just because the wires were getting a little bit caught. Like... Yeah, you can move it around if you need to. You've got a much longer cord than you did last time. I switched it around for you. Thank you. Like, you have one that could reach out into the hall. It'd be a mess, because the cord would ram through a bunch of other shit. But, like... That seems like not a good idea You could all. genuinely hold onto that mic and probably walk into the kitchen. It is that long a cord. That is... You have, like, a 40-foot cable or some bullshit. Jesus Christ. Yeah. I could kill everyone in the neighborhood with that. I actually probably could. Yeah. <laughs> Except... Now Twitch is gonna get angry. <laughs> wow, Twitch, relax! Uh... Like, if, if they want to be angry at me, they'll find a reason. You are ramming the table so hard. No, I'm not. I'm trying to be gentle with my ramming. Don't, 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 talk about, don't talk about gentle ramming. <laughs> I don't think we're allowed to talk about what that. If, what if I'm talking about the it farm doesn't matter. creatures and there's a gentle ram? And mm. he's just being a gentle ram. He's gentle ramming. Are you disrespectful? They'll find a way to get upset. Honestly? If anything, they're probably just going to get upset about me saying they'll get upset about things, and then they'll be fucking out to get me. Then shut up about it. No, because I have to warn you. Because if I don't warn you, then they're going to get mad at me. Look, it's if they want to be mad at me, they'll be mad at me. That's basically how it is. Don't you start Rio Bob. <laughs> maximum Ram isn't nearly as good as Maximum Carnage. That was an awesome game. All right, we're upgrading the makeshift well into a regular well to get us more water, because we do have a lack of water. We also have a small fountain over here. It's to help people drink, basically. We're gonna, uh, our water master will occasionally bring water over to that well. So right now, our small settlement is having a drinking problem, and the problem is that no one is drinking. Yeah. That's really unfortunate. Um, no one's dehydrated anymore. People are having some food shortages, though, so we're gonna drop a spell on that. Do I not have enough, uh... No, even at max. Yeah, even at maximum... Because some people died, I don't have enough spell power anymore, enough essence, to cast the regrowth influence spell. I need a bigger, I need more people. So we just need to make sure there's enough housing, which we only have room for two more people right now. Okay. High priority then, we need to upgrade a house. We're going to do a standard house, so that's going to add three space for 40 wood and 16 stone. Which is a little expensive, but what can you do? We're also going to want an essence collector soon. It'll collect some of the excess essence for us. Crystal. Okay. We could make that ancient uh, radiance pool soon. I think that's a pretty good item. What is a radiance pool exactly? A Radiance Pool in this game, I believe is something that- let me just build that up there. I believe in this game, a Radiance Pool occasionally just generates essence for you, which is what I cast my spells with. So it's just speeding up my rate of getting that, and I'm also up here building an Essence Collector, which will grab it from around the map and hold on to it for me. So I have a stockpile of it, which is really useful. So, it's so that I'm not constantly like running around the map trying to get every little bit of it. It'll store some of it for me, and I can hang out by it and get more. So I got my builders working on that. No available crystal yet. There's only so much to get over here, but my builders will get it. They're just slow at it. Right now, most of my people are working on upgrading this house to get us more housing. All right, let's uh, get rid of two builders. Nomads are coming by. Good, I hope they join. I want another lumberjack. You know what? I just want two more lumberjacks. We're, we have serious shortages of wood. Mark I think I'm having a hard action. time holding the mic because my wrists are a little bit tired from boxing earlier. That might be it. 
Because, like, I can hold it, no problem. It's just holding it for a long period of time, kind of... Salek and Paolo, uh, Paolo joined the village. Good, we got two new people. Yay! Yeah. Let's get another miner, and, uh... Fuck it, a builder. Do we even have anywhere to mine right now? We do. All up in here we're mining. And soon we're going to start turning it in the wood into boards and the stone into cut stone. For further crafting. Would Twitch get mad if I confirmed that you're a wizard? No. Why would they? Actually, you know what? Not a good question. Because <laughs> why, why would they get upset? I don't know why the fuck they get upset about some of the things they get upset about, but they do. I don't think that he's a wizard wolf. I think that he's a mage. Uh, King Number says, still surprised I missed the announcement somehow. Um, if you, if you're on like the, the, the Steam group linked in the description, I send you notifications on that. So that might be helpful. Okay, so we got a standard house there. So we have 16 out of 19 population. So we have no homeless right now, which is good. Lucina, I am boxing. There I... Go. Regrowth smell. I had an objective when I started the year that I wanted to have a fight. I'm not gonna have a fight. I'm just learning as much MMA there as I go. possibly can. Look at that, you can see all the essence flying into our new makeshift essence collector. Mm. So it'll, oh, some of it's coming to me, my cursor, so I get it right away, but it's collecting in there. We can see we can hold 300 essence, which is this lightning bolt. We have 25 so far. So it's just drawing it from across the map for me. And if I need some, I can just hover over this and it'll start giving it to me. Very useful, incredibly useful. I should have made it earlier. Then I'm going to make this Ancient Radiance pool soon. Okay, we have lots of wood now, so upgrade another house to another standard house. Madrat never spars with me. He's actually rude and disrespectful. Uh, I messed up my wrist that one time, so I had to take a little bit of time off of it. And today I just wasn't feeling up for it. I can't mess up my wrist too much because, you know, I've got bad joints because my disabilities. Um, if I mess up my wrist too much, it makes it really hard to do my job because... You know, I'm working with my with my mouse hand and everything. Um, I had to have my wrist basically in a brace for a few days. Who'd you Would dream you... of having to beat? You've, I, I don't know if she's ever going to have like a fucking dream fight. A dream fight. Yeah. She, right now she's just learning like how to throw punches and stuff. She hasn't done like a, a sparring match or anything yet. Today we did kicks and I did really well at kicks even mm -hmm. though I was at an MMA gym kind of like around Toronto somewhere and dead ass um we were kicking at the banks and our man looks at me he's like yeah no you can just um you can just jab cross because you are too short to actually kick and I kind of looked at him for a second like is he joking and then I just I fucking jab cross I was like fuck this man <laughs> We're, this is a bit wide, but we're putting down a wooden fence. Sword training. There we go. Damn, that's exciting shit. Who's doing what? Oh, I think that's Morgan. Is mm. that Morgan? Is Confirm it or deny? the the go the fantasy Gaurav has? Yeah, yeah. Yes. I will learn. I will learn Morgan. Okay, we're getting a wooden fence up because we have a lot of wood stockpiled now. Um, it's not super defensive. It'll just give us a little bit more time to deal with stuff. And we're uh, we're also building some more towers closer to the wall. That is so cool. I hope that you have fun with that. It sounds really intense. Like, you have to be in fairly good condition to, like, jump in and do it. What, sword training? Yeah. Yeah. It's heavy. How we doing? Too many buildings are under construction. Don't yeah, we need to make the settlement bigger soon, which means we actually need refined stuff. We're gonna need boards. On a good day, I'm bad with names, so don't worry. I will, like, at Starbucks, I have to learn people's like names and shit. I will remember everything about what they order and a small detail about their kid. 
or like who they're seeing that week, but their name, God help me, I will never remember their name. I try my best to remember little things about viewers and everything. I, I have a harder time sometimes than others. Um, depends on how memorable the name is, depends on like how much I get to know them. Mm -hmm. If I hear their voice or see their face, that you really helps. Association. Yeah, like if they're in like a session of like Friday 13th, then I tend to remember them pretty well. Mm -hmm. Or like if they send me a Twitter video. It's another reason that I always tell everybody to send Twitter videos. Not only because they're funny, but it makes me remember you way better. Because then I have like a face and a voice to put to you. I've never made a Twitter video. Twitter videos are fun. Should I make one at you? Or at someone? Knowing you, you'll find a way to get our address in, in the video. Quite a few times I've had you gone to like go take a picture or something and I've had to like point out why do you have a license plate in that picture. <laughs> like... I'm sloppy AF. You don't seem to understand how fucking careful you have to be when you're a YouTuber. Like, I'm really careful. Yeah, Chris, I am really, amateur really wrestling careful. is like hard as balls. It's like jujitsu. I was watching a class and these people almost planted on their heads and I was like, nah, I'm not here for this shit. <laughs> I'm not about to die. So this building and building here, by the way, everybody, to talk about the game for a second, it'll increase our building limit a little bit, but also we can have people work at it and they will do logistics for us. They'll carry goods from where they are to where they need to be so that the people working on the specific things don't need to do it themselves. It's very useful. Oh, hey, look, a ghost. Lucina and Bogart, hashtag accurate. Here we go. We just revived a person. Sweet, because we're actually going to need someone to work at this place. So for now, just be a builder. Because we the need to get this stuff built faster. Are enraged or engaged? Enraged. Okay. Uh, it means monsters are going to attack tonight. There's some slimes. Are they in range? Uh, they'll get in range. There we go. I get that fence finished up, guys. Close them out. And we'll summon a uh, holy golem out there. Grab some essence from that. Really want to minimize on people dying. Our pop right now. It's right up here. It's 17. We have housing for 22 people. We always want to make sure that we're a bit above what we have. It'll make nomads more willing to join us. And that's how you get population inside of like childbirth. Because, you know, it takes a while for a child to get born and then grow up. So. Gestational period is 40 weeks. Is it different in this game? Like. Uh, it's like five days for a kid to grow up. LOL. So, uh, but still, nomads are a lot faster. So we want to make sure we always have a lot of housing. Summoning another holy golem there to help fight. We're gonna want to start making swords once we get a forge. Because we do have some iron ingots sitting around somewhere. I think some of it has dissolved unless we carried it into storage, which I'm not sure we have. Um, nah, some of it's just gone away. That's a shame. We'll need to make storage units for those. But we don't have enough building slots. That's why we're working on this. If you mash click on the bodies of dead stuff, it explodes into a little bit more essence, which is what I'm doing. So we have a lot of magic. Interesting. So another holy golem down there. Those holy golems are really putting in work. Ellie's pregnant. Sweet. We need more kids. You know what? Let's go to the makeshift bowyer and tell them to make more Wolf, I'd like stuff. that. What? I like that a lot. What? Wolf is gonna make a Twitter video of himself eating carrots. Do it. It's your thing. It's your thing! Somebody didn't use protection! Oh, Bogart. I didn't know you were reading a Bogart message. I thought you were just being fucking weird about carrots. Oh, that's a great question, Lucina. Um, 
I don't know what the fuck happened, but we accidentally hired an MMA man at my place of employment. And I was like, yo, you wanna train me? I will pay you money to train me. And Mans was like, down. So I was like, right, where do we start? Do I need to become a fitness? Do I need to do real work? Do I, like, what do we do, sir? Coach, man, dude. Mans was like, right. Bob has grown up, just by the way. Disrespect. Right, Mans was like, yeah, let's start with some boxing, basic strikes, and we'll evolve into kicking. And we'll do, um, we'll eventually do, like, more Muay Thai and different types of striking. And then he's like, if you're then into wrestling, like, you'll have to go to, like, a wrestling school. I'm like, sick, let's fucking do it. So, boxing's been really good, because initially I thought it was going to be, like, boring AF. But it's been really sick. I've really enjoyed it. It killed my shoulders for the first month or two that I did it. Like the conditioning that needed to happen sucked. But now that I'm doing it, it's really fun. All right, we almost have those two towers done, good. Uh, they're back to work on the thing that'll get us more building slots and also organizers, which we really need. Is Fatima talking like that on purpose? Uh, no, that's how she talks. Because she's worked at Starbucks for too many years. Hey, Bob. What the fuck are you doing on? Uh, playing a game, talking about dumb shit. That's, that's the Bob you know. Sorry, Bob, there are like four people who called Oh Bo my god, hey, Bob! Not so loud. Why? You're gonna drive me insane. Uh, there are like four people in the community called Wolf Bob, so she's never sure which one's you. Bob Wolf is Bob Wolf, just so you know. That's so exciting. Also, I always sound this dumb, I promise. Even when I'm speaking intelligently, this is my voice. This is how I sound. All right, we're taking off two builders and we're getting two organizers to help get the resources where they need to be, which is super, super, super useful. Smiley Gamer likes my Valley Girl voice, and I love Smiley Gamer's love for my Valley Girl voice. All right, let's, uh, I wish I could rotate buildings. If there's a way to rotate buildings, the game has never told me. You know what? I'm curious. Uh, settings. Ah, it doesn't pause the game when you're in settings. That's brutal. Is there anything that says rotate? Bob Wolf has subscribed! I'll we'll give you acknowledgement in a minute, Bob. Wow. Hashtag delayed acknowledgement. Hashtag why? Uh... Nothing here says rotate. Okay, I don't think you can rotate. Got it. Thanks for the subscription, Bob Wolf. I appreciate it. Play Mario Party with me again. That was fun. Uh, wow, I wish I could rotate that. That's so annoying. Uh, I could destroy terrain on some of those, couldn't I? Yeah, I probably need to. Yeah, destroy some of the stumps to make some room. We have plenty <laughs> of trees there anyway. What is that emoticon supposed to be? Because it looks like your face while you look really disgruntled. That one? You're doing like your million. Me, me surprised. It, it's MDB FTW or uh, FTW? F WTF? WTF, thank you. Uh, except for it, I didn't get to pick the fucking acronym because I am not a Twitch partner, so it's actually Madry WTF. And I'm gonna oh. change it whenever I'm a partner. Electrical storm, don't cry, carry around any metal rods. Okay. Um, this could do some damage to my buildings and I don't have a lightning rod to take care of it. Bye, Doubler. I don't have cut stone yet. Okay. Thank you for chilling with the stream. Thanks for coming by. I appreciate it. Band of nomads. Sweet. I hope they join. We've got a little bit of housing. We have housing for five. 
Okay, I'm gonna get rid of uh, those. And then we'll be able to. Yo, the wolf get this den here. is here! How did I not notice that? Are you aware that Bob. There's, there's Bob Wolf, and then there's Wolf Den, and they're both here. Is Will on Wolf Den's on the Wolf Den account right now? Uh, just here. There's the Bob Wolf. Then there's the Wolf Den. Do you see the Wolf Den before the Wolf Den leaves? Uh, yeah. Is that is that Bob just being weird on both accounts, or think, is that Will? I think that Bob has a right to be as weird as the man desires. Do you know Will? Um, is he the brother of the Bob Wolf? Yeah, it's a collaborative channel between the yes. two of them. Uh, Will does comics, Bob does games. Okay. You've been, like, their chat lesbian before, I think? Uh, yeah. I've, I've done stuff in their chat before, hanging out, having fun. That's so cool. I, I haven't had time to be f there for the live streams for quite a while now, though. Which that's, I feel bad about. It's just, you, got, you guys go live at a time that I'm usually really busy. It's, like, Wednesdays at 8 p.m. Eastern. I'm usually off on Wednesdays. Uh, I you got a check mark. Are you verified now, Bob? The man just... Is that what that means? The check mark? I think that means verified, which I believe means that he is a partner. Could be wrong. You know what? His YouTube channel is big enough to get verified through that now. Because I know I get I get more viewers than him on Twitch. But if your YouTube channel is 100,000 or higher, they'll just partner you through that. And they did pass 100,000 on YouTube. So I think okay. they're verified on YouTube as, as well now, which is really cool. That's like, amazing. For, Congratulations. It's really good for promotional stuff, too. Yeah. Because uh, when people see comments from a channel that's verified, they always check out the channel. All right, so we just got a carpenter. He makes cut. He makes uh, boards, and we're setting it to always try and have 50 boards. So that's a building material for us for better stuff. We're also going to need to go ahead and make a stone stone cuttery so we can cut stone. It's Bob on both. Ah. It's okay, I still like it. I'm still cool with it. Bob, you fucking monster. It's kosher. Relax. Or, Bob, you fucking monster. It's all about how you emphasize the words. He is Bob, two chicks, same time wolf. Is that a thing? Uh, it's how he answered my survey. He entered his use. He entered his username because there's a question. It's like, what username do you go by? He typed in Bob, quotation two chicks same time wolf, which genuinely made me laugh out loud alone in this room. So now I just say that that's his middle name. His middle name is two chicks same time. <laughs> Yeah, Wolf 20 KO is the secret third wolf brother that they keep in the attic. It's, he's the the dark secret of the he's wolf the family. Wolf that they don't talk about. Yeah. Wolf then is partnered. I was part of a Bayer program to upload videos first to Twitch. The Twitch premieres Bayer. They just gave us a partner as part of it. You lucky fucking bastard. I've been streaming since you were a, before you were a YouTuber, and I don't have that. Otherwise, I 100% would not have qualified. My friend Algehill had partner or had um the verified check Didn't on our man have like 120 subscribe and was I think verified? I'll finish this story cuz I have lar I have more info on it. Um, corruption, yep. Um, Are you calling me corruption? Are you disrespectful? Aldrahill, uh, my buddy Aldrahill got the verified check mark on YouTube at 100 subscribers uh, because he went out drinking with a guy who works at YouTube and they gave it to him. Um, he lost it recently because he used Google Plus to change the name of his account, so it's like Aldrahill Games or something. Or rather, no, to like put a space between Aldra and Hill or to get rid of a space between Aldra and Hill, something like that. And they removed his check mark. 
<laughs> he should have never gotten rid of it because he used to get so much traffic on his channel just from people showing up and saying, yo, how the fuck do you get the check mark? <laughs> and a lot of people found through that just for, from commenting on videos and people are like, what? Check mark? How the fuck did he get that? He should have never, he should have never gotten, uh, he should have never fucked with anything because he ended up losing it from that. That's some fuckery. Is that actually a real thing? Yeah, he lost it. No, but like... Say, let's say Philip oh, DeFranco is here. like, he, man's verified, man's large, extra large. The man changes his handle, would he lose his check mark? I think they would, I think he'd lose it for like a day and they'd recheck it and just give it back to him. Because I think it has to be manually verified and name changed to make sure it's not like, I love Hitler.sexy <laughs> is like your new username. Fuck. Actually, I say that, I've seen plenty of usernames that were approved that just like racial slurs and shit. On YouTube, YouTube doesn't give a fuck. You might call it nepotism. I call it networking. <laughs> Says oh Bogart. Bogart, you've been in the YouTube game longer than any of us. You inspired the Spoony one to get started on YouTube. I remember watching him when fuck was I even in high school yet? I don't I think remember. You were in middle, middle school, I think. Because when we were in high school, you told me that you'd been watching um, them. That guy with the whatever. <laughs> I don't need to That was slightly after, but you know. Um, no, it was in high school I started watching that guy with the glasses. Uh, he was around before them. Although he, he did join them at some point. So are we likely to see Super Pig Fucker 64 on YouTube at some point then? Who's you never that? know. Uh, Is that a game? I played a game called YouTuber's Life. It's like a YouTube channel simulator game that was pretty fun. And it let me make a channel name. So I just, I said, oh my God, what's the most immediately offensive and inappropriate channel name I can think of? And then the first thing came to mind was Super Pig Fucker 64. And so that was our channel name. All right, I made a bow up here, a uh, makeshift bow tower because they were coming in through up here. I didn't foresee that happening, but it is what they are doing, so I gotta deal with that now. Would someone please go put Bob some is, ammo in that? Bob is proactive. Our man reached out and was like, yo, I qualify for the check mark. And they were like, yes, sir, you do. Here's your check mark. Yeah, I would have done that too. Like, the second I meet the requirements, fucking tell them so that there's no delay. Same with, like, getting that plaque, you know? I'll be at 100,000 one day. Right now, yeah, I'm just doing my usual growing by like 7,000 a year. It's good. It's slow goings. This game makes me want to play Creeper World, a game that has the same style of this. Do you know Creeper World? No. Might be good, though. Maybe I'll check it out sometime. Maybe our man will check it out. All right, I've got to summon some more holy golems. I've been kind of dragging my feet on that, but I think we need it now because they're just all funneling in through this. Oh, wolf, my main man. You're already a wolf. It's too late for you. Oh, a dog joined the village. Let's make a dog house so that they're not wasting room in the people houses. Make a dog house by the front. There we go. I and can, we I can, can finally imagine. we can finally upgrade this. I should have done that a while ago, but we're upgrading that now because it uses refined materials, which we now actually have quite a few boards. King numbers, man. This game to me looks complicated. But there's a lot of moving parts occurring constantly, and it looks difficult to manage unless you know what you're doing and understand, like, what your objectives are short term and long term. Yeah, I'm still pretty new to the game, but playing on an easier difficulty helped me figure it out. Uh, now we're on the standard difficulty, which is very hard compared to the the other one. There was like the recommended learning one, and then this is the recommended in general one. And there's a big difference in difficulty. Uh, you work tomorrow, right? 10, 10 a.m.? I think I work 10 a.m. to 6. Okay. All right, we should wrap up sometime soon-ish. It's 11, right? It's 11-ish right now. I don't know. I'm having fun. I'm having a good old time. All right, we still have plenty to break up there. Good. How long ago would you have been at four thousand sub? Four thousand? Yeah. Um, five years, something like that. Four, four or five. 
Four. Actually, no, five, five. Definitely five. Definitely um, five. Because I got my big growth spurt in like uh, 2013 on the channel. Mm -hmm. And 2014 was my peak year in terms of growing the most in a year. And that was four years ago now. Wow. By the way, everybody, I was uh, recording something earlier today that everyone's going to be really happy about. That's going up next week. I guess I'll tell you as a little bonus for coming to the stream live. It wasn't Earthbound. No, uh, Pokemon Platinum is coming back. Recorded three episodes of it today with What a Geek. Get excited for that. We're probably going to record a whole bunch of it. Um, right, yeah. I did say hello to What a Geek earlier. Yeah, that that was why we were in a call together. Uh, for anyone who didn't watch the Pokemon Platinum series, it's really fucking fun. It's basically Flash Trash, but with a Pokemon game. Where it's just us being fucking stupid, and Brandon's there for a whole bunch of it. Is that a real option, Bogart, to do the NES Earthbound? Like, is that a real option? Yeah. It works. Really? Yeah, I've told you a thousand times. Isn't that what we emulate? Yeah. There's the NES one, the SNES one, and the GBA one. Which one Which one did you set up for me? You played Earthbound, which is Mother 2. Which is... No, it was... SNES. It was, uh... It was Zero. No. Zero's the first one. But I, in in I, Japan, I... it's Mother 1, Mother 2, Mother 3. English market, it's Earthbound. And that's Mother 2. Sometimes fans translate the NES Earthbound, or the NES Mother, to Earthbound Zero. And then Mother 3 never came out in English. There's just a really good fan patch. Real stress. This is real stress. Truth says, been thinking again to Earthbound after Final Fantasy Tactics. Earthbound's really fun. It's a really fun game. It's one of those ones that you might worry is overhyped, but no, it's legitimately very good. I feel like when you got me into it, I was kind of like, oh, I don't know if I'm going to like this, because he was explaining it to me, and I was like, this don't sound so great. This snack does not sound appetizing. But then, when I began to unwrap the snack, I was quite enticed. I was very involved. The game was really good. Earthbound 7 for the N64? Is this um, like a Final Fantasy joke? That is completely yeah, yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a Final Fantasy joke. You remember I explained <laughs> to you before? You know how I explained to you before about how... Um, you know I explained to you before about how Final Fantasy, they were like... There was like the a first six Of the first six games... Of the first six games, only three of them came out in English and they, were, and they weren't... Uh, oh, hey, Sonic Blast 21 joined the... They, they joined the village. Wow. Um, you tell me after it's gone from the screen. I was circling it with my mouse. Yeah, and I can't actually see that because the crane arm is actually blocking my view. Anyway, um, yeah, so uh, you remember how I told you before about Final Fantasy and how the first six came out in Japan and then the ones that came out in English weren't one, two, and three. It was one, uh, one four, and six. And so they just called it one, two, three. But then when 7 got translated to English, they just called it 7 anyway. So it looked like a bunch of games were just missing. Uh, until they got re-released later with the correct numbers. That's some true fuckery. Yeah, it's confusing. All you need to know is Earthbound is Mother 2. What is that? All you need to know. Is that what you would want to play? Yeah, the that's, that's the one you played. But is that what you would want to If play? you want to, we can do Mother 1, then 2, then 3, and I think the story has the best impact if you do it that way, but I believe all the games work well as standalones, where you don't need to have played any of the others. And it you would still get a lot of emotional impact out of it. Like, I played Earthbound before I played Mother, and I think I would have liked Earthbound more if I'd played Mother first, uh, but ultimately it didn't really matter. I still love Earthbound. I think it's really important for you to create a poll so that the people can speak. What does Poland have to do with this? No, 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 no. I'm the king of shit jokes, everybody. What? I actually didn't pay attention to what you just said. You know what? It's better that way. <laughs> Life is hard. 
The king of not being funny strikes again. <laughs> Bogart man, I won't do whatever he wants. I'm giving it to the people. Y'all get to decide what y'all want to see. Poorly watered? What is so poorly watered about this? You have a water source right fucking there, and it's is got it tons of water low? in it. Is it being overused? No. Um, I'm wondering uh, if the water up. masters are overburdened. Let me get another water master. Maybe they're just having a hard time getting water everywhere because one guy's running around too much. We'll need to get um, roads set up soon to increase our travel speed, and we're also going to need more population, so let's bump up more of these make makeshift houses into standard ones. What about JFK? What? JFC? What? What the fuck does JFC stand for? Is some youth shit that I don't get? I'm not you're sure. you're hip to the youth of today and I'm tomorrow. I'm really not. I'm supported. You by work with them. Today. Yeah, and they they've taught me some slang words. David, honestly, we're both capable of being quite rude and quite disrespectful to one another. Um, hey guys, IDK stands for I don't know. I think he's being sarcastic. Oh. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Na, 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 na. Bludgeon Brothers. <laughs> That's the Bludgeon Brothers theme. <sighs> we ruined his joke. Oh, dear. You're supposed to say, I don't know. And he's like, nobody knows. John nope. fucked Connor? Who is John, and why did he fuck Connor, and why is this a thing that we say to each other? John Cena and Connor McCloud. What? John Cena and Connor McCloud. Who's Connor McCloud? Connor McCloud of the Clan McCloud? Who's the Clan McCloud? What is the Clan McCloud? What planet are they from? There's a movie called Highlander. It's really good. Oh, this is the thing that you've been wanting me to watch that you... you, you, you yeah. Apparently a lot of your jokes, like, come from it or some shit? No. But I'm pretty sure you- no. a, lot of, a lot of my jokes come from Wet Hot American that's... Summer. <laughs> and you saw that. I don't agree with that statement. You're offending me. I'm gonna go write about it in my <laughs> gurnal. On what? In my gurnal. I thought you were gonna go to your tumbler. No, my gurnal. Your girdle? Gurnal. You fucking... It was like a year ago that you watched this movie and you forget Gurnal already? Who's Gurnal? What's Gurnal? He was writing in his journal, but he called it his Gurnal. Wet Hot American Summer is the funniest comedy I've ever seen in my life. I can no longer cope with the pain. So fucking good. What a fucking awesome movie that is. Unbelievably funny. I can no longer cope with the pain. <sighs> Actually, all MDB's jokes come from Highlander and Highlander 2. Now, Highlander 2 is a joke. All right, here's the enemy is good. So this whole thing I set up here seems to be working in that there. Nope, some of them walk through this way, but some of them walk this way. Okay, it's helping a little. Red hot American summer. That is not, it's wet hot American summer, not red hot. Did it's, that Radio Shack go under? They tried to like get merged with someone and then they just like died. I thought you were gonna say something very different. What did you think I was gonna say? You say like they get murdered. It's like, no, I don't, I don't think Radio Shack was like soliciting Probably their so. own assassination. Is that even an assassination, or is that assisted suicide? I feel like they filed for bankruptcy like three times where they actually died. Cause so, like, two people jumped in to save them. Bye, Wolf! If anybody wants to make a highlight of this stream, or they just like edit together the funniest moments... The um, dumbest shit that Fatima does, like when I unplugged my mic! 
<laughs> yeah. If anyone wants to like make highlights of my of my casual streams, just like do it, and then like send it my way, and I'll upload it and give you credit and shit. It'll be awesome. All right. Well, that tower exploded. I think I've spent a lot of time embarrassing myself this evening. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Na 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 na. I need your widow. Do you really not know that song? Like, relax. Do you really not know that song? No. It's Bludgeon Brothers. <laughs> Why are you lying? <laughs> Why are you lying? Chat, please educate her on how that's the Bludgeon Brothers theme. Guys, I know that it's not. I watch enough wrestling that I can identify that that is she not- She doesn't even know the, the Bludgeon the Brothers brother theme. The Brother Bludgeon theme? The Bludgeon Brothers theme. She doesn't even know how it goes. Sir, are you disrespectful? All right, hum the Bludgeon Brothers theme if you think you know what it is. I don't. <laughs> what am I doing? See, Wolf gets it. Where? The most recent message. Crazy taxi? Yeah, the Bludgeon Brothers theme. The theme is not from a movie called Crazy Taxi. There isn't a movie called Crazy Taxi. I'm pretty sure there is. If there is, I haven't heard of it. And I've heard of every movie that's ever existed. Wow, why do you scroll through IMDb like you have no life? I don't. You do? You... I, I don't. I don't like IMDb. I don't like their overlay, or their layout, rather. Uh, that farm's it? almost dead. Fucking, someone deal with that already. We need guards. Is this going up on YouTube? Yeah, this is going up on YouTube. Oh, shit. <laughs> I was okay. about to make a great joke about that, but then Twitch wouldn't think it's a great joke. <laughs> oh, dear. Bye, Morgan! See you, Morgan. Is it dealing with that? Good. I want to start getting our Fletcher to make more ammo. God, we have so many repairs that need to be made. I don't like that we're on the water like this. It's so awkward how this is positioned. There we go, we can wall up a little bit better. Sonic Blast. I hate jokes about German sausages. They're the worst. I think... I mean, I was about to make a German joke too. But... I think that Sonic has teethed my joke because that's a thing that I say to people is I'm not, the w I'm, I'm not a sausage, but I am the worst. Whenever I make a really bad joke. That's how you feel? Real stress. Real stress. Been meaning to watch you live. Uh, getting to now. Well, um, I'm sorry for your impending regrets. I'm not sorry. Wow. <laughs> our man is... Our man is rude. <laughs> Thanks for following, uh, Krasden Storm. Welcome to the flock. Bob Wolf. Sounds weird to welcome you to the flock. Thank you for subscribing, by the way. I really appreciate that. I think I thank you for that. Thank uh, you for subscribing, Bob Wolf. Uh, Morgan donates 100 bits, which is one American dollar. Damn. And says, uh, what's up, dog? Thank you, Morgan. There's too much dog. That's what's up, dog. Bogart sends 501 bits and says, yeah. uh, nobody is allowed to leave. <laughs> Echo Helion's following. Open the flock. You've been yeah. on forever. Bogart sends another 50 bits and says, you can't cut back on finding funding. You'll regret this. I feel like that's a reference that's just over my head. And thanks, uh, Arch Revan, for subscribing. I really appreciate that. I hope you enjoy your shitty fucking emotes. I hope that you enjoy the beautiful content that we are producing together. Is beautiful the right word? I'm on screen. 
You're a handsome man. I cleaned up my beard a lot this week. I'm lucky that you don't look the nice, house right? or someone would teeth you from me. Look at that. That's a nice looking beard. Look at that on that, that side shot. That's good. Listen, I get to see it in real life. I'm going to see it on screen too. <laughs> I never see it from this angle, so. <laughs> Looks nice. I like it. I cleaned it up a little. My man would get teethed. I think I've shown photos to three people of us together and they're like, oh my God, your husband is so cute. And I'm like. That's just cause they like you. No, no, no. They could be saying that we are cute. We. Okay, so unit. <laughs> one's, so your your defense your of it. Your husband is so cute. Your Can you stop looking at my husband like he's a piece of meat? Your defense of it. It still implies that they're not genuinely saying I'm cute. They think you're cute. Uh, everybody has a right to be wrong, I guess. Lucina likes me. Who? Lucina? Who? It's Lucina. Who? It's Lucina! It's right there! Oh, in the chat. I thought you meant someone from work, and I'm like, I've never heard you bring up a Lucina from work. Hi, Lucina. I hope you're enjoying the stream. Sorry that I just- Sorry that it sounded like I just she said that I didn't know you me. exist like four times, but I thought she was still talking about work. This man really tried it. Uh, what do you get when you cross an owl with a bungee cord? I mean, Smiley Gamer, it's- you're not wrong. They're like- they're appalled that- I'm crazy and married. And they're like, who are you married to? We need to teeth this person. We need to see who your husband is. And so this man never comes out with me. So they're like, you must be making him up. I have an answer. He said, uh... What's your answer, sir? He said, what do you get when you cross uh, a bungee cord with an owl? Disrespect. Who gives a shit? I feel Get it, like who? Like an owl? Like who gives a shit? This is disrespect. Disrespect! Thanks, Truth! <laughs> I'm gonna send you to Perth. Do you understand? No one lives in Perth. That's why I'm sending you there! Oh my god, I'm gonna be Perth's first human? Holy shit! No one can teeth you from me That's quite the if you are room. in Perth! Yeah, you won't be in Perth either! Two people can't live in Perth. Come on. Listen. I think if I go to Perth, I'm not even a human anymore. You just become a kangaroo. Kangaroos don't live in Perth. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> uh. My answer was my ass, but sure. Oh. Great. Hold on. I, I think I need to call someone. <laughs> Oh, is somebody having an emergency? Oh wait, I can, I can. Don't call them on stream. Leaving. Okay. <laughs> Close the door. <laughs> Someone's probably having some fucking emotional meltdown. All right, well, you're with me now, chat. Sorry. <laughs> oh, that's fun. All right, we got to turn that into a gate, don't we? Can we just... Turn to get like that? No. Gotta dismantle bits of it. Got it. Uh, yeah, God. Monsters are restless. We had to get so many towers down. This is so much harder than the previous difficulty I tried. Okay, uh, population-wise, we could use more housing, so let's upgrade another one to standard. And we actually have one spare population. Let's get a guard shack now. Actually, no, better than that. We need a refining. We need a forge. Mm. I hate trying to find good spots for things. Because uh, I don't want things to be too far away from their route. Okay, I can I can deal with this. Yeah, get rid of those two, because we do have food still growing over there. Was that all trees? No, there's food there. Good. Uh, people are complaining about not having food, so we're trying to fix that right now. All right. Uh, I want yeah, forge. 
Fuck, I gotta get rid of those two as well? Okay. I used to have facial hair, but it grew on me. I like that. Actually, it would be and it grew on me. That doesn't make sense. Never mind. I don't like that. I take it back. I thought about it, and then it didn't make sense. There we go. Getting a forge going so we can start turning the metal into ingots. Really love the visual so far. It's a fun game. I like it. Sorry you can't read anything. There's honestly nothing I can do about that. Um, the game has some serious UI scaling issues. Okay, there we go. We have another bow turret. We just need to get some ammo into it. I'm summoning a holy golem there. Would you deal with that, please? Thank you. Just trying to save that turret. I don't want to break him. Do we have the stuff necessary to upgrade these? We do. Okay, we do want to start upgrading the turrets. Could someone get some ammo in that? Tower, please. Ah. A lot of our people have bows, at least, so we have some ranged attack, although it's not very strong. I want to get a swords. Some of these enemies have dropped equipment, at least. Yeah, these holy, uh, these holy golems aren't cutting it as well as they used to. Trying to get a little bit of essence back for more spells. Would you recommend this game? It's really fun and it's not very expensive. A little bit of a learning curve, but that's not bad. Okay, get some essence over here. Come on, there we go. Summon another golem to help hold off the hordes. And explode some of the bodies so we can get more quick essence. There we go. Hey Truth, you play, um, you play, uh, Streets of Rogue, right? You know that game has Twitch integration? I've been thinking about streaming it. I really like that game. I have like every character unlocked in it and stuff and almost every achievement. I used to have every achievement, but then they added the fifth zone. Okay, it's daytime, so enemies will stop attacking either of the ones that are already here. Good. Band of Nomads, sweet. No available cut stone. Do we have anyone working on cutting stone? I believe we do. Yeah, we do have somebody working on that. Oh no, I think they destroyed our place where we were making cut stone at. Shit, did they destroy it? I'm back. Uh, I think they did destroy it, unless I just never built one and I'm pretty sure I built one. Stone cuttery, yeah. Yeah, I think we used to have one up there. Um, we'll have to make one farther away. That sucks. That was someone from my old store who didn't know the alarm code to lock up the store. Great. Oh, I'm happy that you solved that issue. But they also were like, so you can poach the entire store and they'll come with you to your new store. Yep, because everybody wants to go to the store you work at. All right, there we go. We got that going. I really want to get a Pathfinder place started so we can build roads. It'll help our travel speed substantially. Okay, we actually need to upgrade this place as well to get more building slots and so that they work faster. It looks like you have a couple of shacks up. Yeah, um, we're getting more and more buildings up here. We're getting a stone cuttery so we can start getting better equipment. And we're going to finish up this wall. I was named after my grandmother. So my I'm mom asking originally... about your name? Yeah, Lucina. Uh -huh. You should say out loud. Give them credit. It's Lucina. Fatima, where is your name from? See, Question I, mark. I, I like to do that because uh, yes. people listen to these streams and stuff and mm -hmm. they, they want context, you know? Like some sometimes people uh, use this as background noise. 
So it's nice giving them credit vocally like that so that everybody's on the same page. Oh, I see. That way people don't need to hunt for the message in the chat as much. I see. Yeah. Uh, you might not be able to tell from here, but Fatima's uh, Iraqi Turkmen. She's Arab and Turkish. It's hard to tell because her skin tone is very light. So if you're wondering why a white person is called Fatima, she's not white. I'm not a pork chop either. Yeah. And before anyone goes thinking that's a racial slur, Twitch. It's not. Oh. Portuguese call themselves pork chops. It's yeah, a fucking no, joke. Every Portuguese person I've ever met is like, yeah, I'm a pork chop. I'm like, yeah, that, that's that a, a that's a that's a they're thing they're, they're proud like, of. I have Portuguese nah. people in the fan base. They're cool with it. It's weird. Anyways, as I was so rudely interrupted, my my um. My mom wanted to name me Sarah when I was first, like, when she was first pregnant with a girl. And then they lied to my grandma and were like, yeah, it's a boy, it's a boy, it's a boy. And then when I entered the world, I was not a boy and she was really mad. So she called my dad up and she was like, son, like, I'm so sorry that you were cursed with a girl. My dad just turns to my mom, he's like, Yo, she's pissed. We should maybe name her, name the daughter after my mother. Maybe she'll be less pissed. And, and do you be getting work. triggered? Oh no, I'm not getting triggered. It's fucking Twitch. They're what? so. It's. A, uh, say, and Dallas Show said, MDB getting triggered. No, it's not me. Believe me, it's Twitch. That's why I need to fucking clarify this shit. Twitch are fucking Nazis when it comes to this shit. When so get I'm careful. Calling them Nazis, though. Oh, they call everybody Nazis. I'm sure they're. It's that kind of people. Yeah. So I was named Fatima after my grandma, and the really funny thing is Fatima is like the Sarah of the Middle East because it's a name that Jewish, Muslim, and Christian families would name their daughters. It was just a common name among so many communities there. Whereas, like Sarah, would have been a rarer name. For whatever reason but then we moved here to canada and sarah is such a common name that i'm happy that my name is not common but it really sucked growing up with that name because i grew up in a mostly white like caucasian community where people are like oh is your name said fatima like no it's fatima and then sometimes people would be like yeah, that's nice, Fatima. I'm like, yeah, so you can just call me Sarah. Like, fuck this. I'm not dealing with your shit. Yeah, a lot of people say that because in some in some cultures it is pronounced Fatima. Mm -hmm. um, and so that's probably why a lot of people fuck up is that's a more common pronunciation over here. Yeah. All right, things are going pretty well so far. Uh, we're really cleaning the place up. Marinari. Yes. Yes. All right, we have a smelters now. Isn't that for like coal? I mean, we're using it for uh, we're using it for smelting iron ore and gold ore into iron, gold, and coin. Um, and then we're going to start making that into tools and weapons and stuff soon. Truth. Um, a few people have tried. Those people have, um, have... Calling you fat or fatty? Yeah. For, yeah, short, yeah. A few people have tried, but other people kind of shut it down because they don't like hearing it. They realize it's really cruel, yeah. Yeah, and like, I'm cool with it because I get that it's like part of my name. And I know they're not calling me fat. They're just calling me like Fatima, like... Yeah. There's not malicious intention, it's yeah. just fucking idiotic. <laughs> You'd think they'd understand not to just call somebody that. I mean, my favorite, like, nickname so far has been Fatiti, which is fucking weird. Because it's so unique. Like, what the fuck is that? It's special. Uh. Good night, Bogart and Madam Bogart. Thank Bogart, you. Bogart, hit me up whenever you got that uh, patch for Resident Evil Outbreak to play online. That's gonna be fun. Like the, the Japanese English patch thing. And whenever you got that figured out, hit me up. Yes. Good night. Thank you for coming to the stream. It's been so great. Actually, you know what? Let's let's keep a little bit of this as well. There, 
keep a little bit of that for my own defense. Yeah, I I think I got to that stage too, Marinari, where I was like, yep, I'm the only Fatima here. However you're going to butcher my name, I'll just respond because I know who you're talking to. Yeah, I more or less did that as well. Because you got to keep in mind, like, for as much as I'm sure you had to deal with people mispronouncing your name, it's not even close to mine. Yeah, no. Because mine's from a dead language, so... You know what's funny is my doctor today, when I was like, oh, like, my husband's name is, like, Madrat, she was like, oh, that is such a rare name, blah, blah, blah. It's incredibly rare, it's in a dead language. So then I said, Taco Man! Thanks, thanks Hi, for the, uh, th Man. thanks for the three-month resub. It says resub two over there, but over here it's telling me three months, so I'm gonna say three months. Hi, Taco Man! Thanks, I appreciate it. Enjoy your shitty emotes. Sell your show any worse. Don't hit tune in next time. You've got better things to do. I might be there next time. Everybody ask for refunds on your donations. I'll give them. This man's causing world problems. World problems. Anyways. And I was explaining to the doc, like, oh, it's like Welsh. The man's not Welsh. La la la. She's like, yeah, I know. I understand. I've heard. I was like, King Arthur. She's like, yes, I know. Yep. I'm like, lady, relax. <laughs> Honestly, truth, I don't know. I really don't know. <laughs> okay, let's get a kitchen. So we can start making proper food rations. I mean that or you could stay tuned in, but also do your laundry. I don't know why you can't multitask. Stay tuned in? What the fuck? Full moon. Monsters are calm during a full moon and lighting is better. Oh, hey. Suspicious key. Maybe we can open that chest we have in our place. Marinari says get out while you still can. LOL. Marinari really tried it. Really tried it. Nah, I'd have to close the room and unfollow to start doing laundry. Clearly the only way. Truth Fucking man. do it! You know where it's at! Truth man, relax! No, he's got it. Okay, the forge is up there. Can I find a toolsmithy up there? Not really. Damn. Waymaker Shack. God, we need one of those. We're just kind of stocking up on buildings that we'll need later. Taco Man says, nope, I just built a huge chain link fence, so this is my chill time. Ah. What's that mean? What's that code for something? No, I think he literally builds fences. Oh, shit. That's so cool. Hmm. Sonic Blast. What is your litmus test for something being considered cool? Building chain link fences? Listen, I'm what they call ignorant, okay? I don't know a lot of shit. So when I learn shit, I am fascinated by that shit and I'll be like, yeah, that's so cool. You're right, that is so Raven. I'd never thought about it that way. Sonic Blast says, well, I'm just going to listen to your other videos on my phone. You know, I used to fall asleep to this man's videos back mm. before we lived together because I loved him. Mm. You loved. <laughs> I loved him. And now. Not anymore, Jesus, since he started living with me. Wow. You realized your mistake. <laughs> I sing the Bludgeon Brothers theme. You sing All... everything at me and you tell me it's Bludgeon <laughs> Brothers. You're disrespectful. <laughs> <laughs> Swing your arms from side to side. It's the Bludgeon Brothers. <laughs> Shut up with the Bludgeon Brothers. <laughs> you like the Bludgeon Brothers. I do. Yeah, they're great. I do. I love them. Big Luke Carper, Eric Rowan. What? You're just not a, you're not enough of a, uh, a, a Bludgeon Brothers fan. You're not as much of a, a BB fan. The BB boys you as I am. You can train ravens to tea for you. The, the crushing cousins. them when they bring you shiny things. Yeah? Oh my god. Holy god, a flavor town is here. 
Hello, Holy God of Flavor Town! Hey, Holy God of Flavor Town. You came at a bad time to a bad stream. Okay. But draw it. Say less. I'm here. Say less. It's not gonna happen. People need their Bludgeon Brothers themes to be sung, and so I'm here to sing do, it. Do, 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 do. Bludgeon Brothers. I got, I got it, right? That's the song you were singing? Yeah, Bludgeon Brothers, the crushing cousins, the killing it kinsmen. It sounds incestuous. Uh, the crushing cousins? Yes. No, they crush people with their mallets. <gasps> Don't you see them with their mallets? The killing cousins? The killing cousins, the killing kinsmen. Cousins. They kill people with their mallets. What is my life? What are you talking about? I love your stream. Bad decisions. Bad decision making. I don't approve of that. Liking my stream? What the fuck? Truth says more like they crush each other's butts. Is this like a tush whooping or something? Yeah, with their mallets. Oh, it's like I one, it. one of them has been bad, so they spank them with their mallet. There's nothing oh. sexual about it. Stop being weird. Oh. Smiley Gamer and a bunch of other people joined the village. I gotta say, this Twitch integration is not very good. It doesn't always name them after people in the chat. But fuck it, we just got four people, and we really needed them. To be specific, but fuck it. Is it just... Is the Twitch integration in general shitty, or is it just shitty with this game? With this game, it doesn't seem to be working 100%. With some games, it's great. Like, with Domina, it's fucking awesome. I hear Hands of Fate 2 has very good integration. I've been writing down games today that have good integration for future use. Are you yawning because my show's boring? Shut up. You're disrespectful. Are you yawning because my show is... I'm yawning. Boring? I'm yawning because I don't have uh, iced coffee. From McDicks. Is <laughs> the shit that I need? I work for the Starbs, but I crave the McDonald's iced coffee. It's a real problem. <laughs> I fucking I properly I properly got a ice cap and I took it to work and my boss lady fully reamed me out for it. She's like, what would our leaders think? La la la. Our leader makes it sound like Our North leaders. Korean. Anyways, just like, how could you bring this in the back room? This is it Starbucks? That's Tim Hortons. That's unacceptable. La la la. She's like, you can put it to a Starbucks cup with a Starbucks straw. So I'm like, all right. So I go get one. I put it in. I go back on the floor. This bitch fully drinks my ice cap. Wow. I come back. I'm like, uh, hey, did you drink my ice cap? Where the fuck is it? She's like, oh shit, I'm so sorry. Let me buy you another one. I'm like, fucking right answer, bitch. <laughs> so she bought me an ice cap and a donut. I'm like, yes! I just want to point out Fatima's being promoted right now. Like, she's now an assistant store manager. She's going to be a store manager probably shortly thereafter. And, um... This is the bullshit that I fucking do. Yeah. <laughs> I, well, when you run your own store, which is probably going to be pretty soon, you can have all the fucking Tim Hortons you want. But if our leaders come in, fuck do we do? I don't give a shit about North Korea. Mm. All right, we got two more Waymakers and another organizer. In fact, I'd really like to get more organizers. There we go, we got that upgrading again. Is that like city planner type of people that would like- Organizers? Yeah. They Where carry they goods exactly? from one place to wherever it needs to be so that the people who would normally be working on it like don't need to. So like the person who's making boards doesn't need to go to the lumber mill and get the wood. An organizer will carry it to them for them. And the way makers make roads. So we're about to make a bunch of roads. So paths are free, but they get stomped down over time. So we're gonna want to replace those very quickly with like little boardwalk things. Road making is a bit of a tedious pain in the ass, but it drastically speeds up your production of everything. How's it been almost an hour since I said it's 11? <laughs> Holy shit. It's 11 right now, isn't it? It's 11.44. Oh, it hasn't been an hour, it's been 44 minutes. That is correct. That's why I said almost an hour. 
So what I'm gonna do is save and exit here because I try to go to bed at midnight because I don't want to fuck up my sleep schedule too bad. I, I want to do more of these casual streams way earlier in the day, guys. Maybe when Fatima's got days off or whatever. And Fatima doesn't always have to be here for the casual streams. It's just fun that way. Do you guys like it when I'm here? Do I talk too much? Am I annoying? I think be they real. like. They seem to like it when you're here. They stay a lot more. But we we did lose uh, about like a third, almost a third of our viewers there. But that's mostly that's the Europeans. That's right? mostly yeah. Like the Europeans locking off is very late for them now. Um, we came on when they were all just, were they all coming in and just saying like, why are you streaming so late? And then now a lot of them are tapping out. I don't blame them. Mm -hmm. Anyway, uh, thank you everybody for coming to the stream. I hope that you enjoyed. Um, I'll upload this at some point. At some point. Um. Thank you, Smiley Gamer. I. Jordan, I like that. Got plenty to work on. Um. What well, Fatima is better than MDB is true. Hashtag better than MDB. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to get back to working on some other stuff and I'm going to go to bed real soon. Can Fatima um, replace MDB? Uh, she doesn't know how to operate any of this equipment. You got, Guys, you remember earlier in the stream when she tried to turn up her <laughs> microphone by unplugging it? She said, what does this do? She held it in and unplugged the cable. <laughs> on moment and I promise I'm surprised like you were able to find the on button for your microphone on the audio interface even though the the on button for mine was glowing next to it and I gave you instructions you thank you everybody so for coming to the stream I hope that you enjoyed uh I'm gonna get this edited maybe render it out tonight I'll I'll see about when I upload it and uh I'll try to keep you posted on when the next stream will be again join the steam group if you want to know whenever we go live and I'll do more rise to ruins because this game is really fun actually I'm surprised I managed to pull off uh, a decent comeback there because it was really rough on the second night. You were burning the whole village down. Yeah, I didn't, really were. I didn't prepare well enough. Uh, I didn't know the walls were so important that early. Considering on my other file, the walls, I, I made like a fence on like day 10. Whereas on this, you need a proper wall on day two. Um, yeah, so thanks everybody for coming by and uh, we will see you guys again soon. Until next time, have a nice day. Have a good night, everyone.